We live in a time of profound demographic changes. One of these is that over just a 20-year period, the average age at which women are having their first child in Australia has moved from about 25 years of age up to over 30 years of age. On the 1st of June this year, epidemiologist and demographer Mark McCrindle and I will explore some of the implications of these changes to people who are prospective parents and to society as a whole. One of the big problems I have in my clinical practice is that frequently I will see men and women who come above the age of 40 desperate to start a family and have their children. Sadly, even these days, there's little I can offer those people apart from consideration of adoption or maybe using a donated egg from another person. Even these days, the amazing scientific advances in the world of IVF have little else to offer. There are other things to consider from the world of science, however, for example, freezing of eggs for young women so that they can defer having their children till they're of older age, and also possibly some research that may allow people to prolong their reproductive life for a few years. In any event, the talks we're going to give will show that everyone should consider these changes because they have implications for all of society, for people who wish to become grandparents, as well as those who wish to become parents, have brothers and sisters or children. These are issues that we all need to consider and to reflect upon.